We're going to start this video off by looking at some of the basics of the Mac operating system. So right now we're on the desktop and sometimes you'll hear it referred to as the Finder. The Finder is kind of like the, the point in on the Mac where you jump off into other programs and, and other things. So you can use it to organize things. Uh, it would be where you would open you know, basic folder windows and things like that. Uh, at the bottom, uh, you have what's known as the dock. Any open applications will show up here, as well as any applications that you use frequently and have added to the dock. For example, I'm recording this with a program called ScreenFlow, and if I click on that, uh, I have some options. So I can see I have one untitled project, and of course that is bad. You never want a project called Untitled, but I will change that when I say it in a few minutes. I have options, and one of the options I have here is Keep in Dock. So if there's software that you use frequently, say a video editor like Final Cut or Premiere, and you want it to be readily available and easy to open when you start up the operating system, you can select keep it in the dock and whenever you log in that will be one of the options you have there. Now uh, the other thing we have on the dock we have a, uh, a trash can similar to the recycle bin on a Windows computer if you delete a file it will go here and then in order to delete it permanently you have to right click and go empty trash. Now, right now, we don't have anything in the trash bin, so this is grayed out. Here, uh, the two little icons next to it, they um, show that I have two projects that have been minimized. So if I wanted to jump back to that particular application, in this case, this is an Adobe After Effects project, and this Untitled, again, we don't want any files called Untitled, so as soon as I'm done the recording, I will change that. This is the screen recording that I'm doing right now. That's the application for it. So um, again, we look at the desktop. I can see my external hard drive here, the shares drive, and then DW Macintosh. Stand, DW stands for Downtown Waterfront. And that is the hard drive for the computer. The hard drive for the computer is, is what would be known as the local hard drive. My hard drive is also local. It's attached directly into the computer. The shares folder would be what would be known as a network drive. You will also see when you log in, um, you will usually see a W drive here. That's your own personal network storage space. At the top, we have this little bar. This is notifications. This is pretty useless for us because we're working on shared computers. But if you have your own Mac, you can set that up however you want. Here we see the date. This is AirPlay. So if there was an Apple TV in the vicinity, here you can see there's one um, music one. Then we could actually take whatever we have on this computer and use AirPlay to kind of just project it on that other computer.